introduce you. I like to think of it more as a variety show. You'll hear that it's a male beauty pageant, but I think the past two years that we've done it, we've shifted it more from like the, you kind of walk arm in arm with like a pretty lady and like do a whole thing to now it's like a show, it's a storyline. There's like each guy brings a different aspect to the show. They have a talent. Um, and at the end, they like the top three get interviewed and then you get to pick from who you think represents the school the best. So it's kind of just like a really fun, like variety talent show for like two hours and then you get a Mr. GCU out of it, so. Yeah, okay, yeah. Are you gonna re-ask them like live or my? My name is Joe Riccardi. Uh, I am a second semester junior. Honestly, I should win Mr. GCU just cause like, if we just wanna spit facts and like only facts, I just think that would be the most factual. Why should I win Mr. GCU? I honestly don't think I should. There's a lot of really great guys here. I'm just honored to even be considered and in the competition. My name is Stefan Chattermall and I am a senior here at GCU. <laughs> Somebody call now. Kind of a joke, um, really. I remember choreographing it with um, with Janessa, my assistant, and <laughs> we, I think I collapsed or something. And I was like, I just have this crazy idea. Like crazy ideas just come into my head sometimes. I can't explain its origin or genesis. And there, I, I collapsed, and she's like, Oh, really? That's it? And then they said nine one one. I was just like pounding on the ground, and they're like, Oh, it's in. <laughs> I went in without having a talent. I was just like, I'll do it. Let's see if I make it. And I did, and I was like, oh, now I gotta do something. The favorite part about being in Mr. GCU is the boys. Getting to hang out with the boys, it's a lot of fun. And these practices have been phenomenal. Getting to know the other guys, and it's just been a blast. We're the best of friends. And if you don't have friends, please call us. My name's Josea, his name's Luis, his name is Joe. Call us at Josea, Luis, and Joe at 1-800-588-2654 for three best friends. Friendship. Bendy, bendy, flexy, flexy. You know, get the new one, the old one, you know. Yeah. Uh, okay. okay. How does it feel? Uh, you're hot? I'm not Physically, hot. spiritually, no. emotionally? The spirit of the Lord's in me, but... Amen. Physically, I don't want to be cock cocky. Cocky? <laughs> I don't want to be cocky. I don't want to be cocky either. Hey, guys, we do have other tall people, too, here at GCU. You know, we have them. Seven hold on, hold on. He's really tall. What? And if you're into tall guys... I'd like to win Mr. GCU because I just want to be a positive impact through the things I do, like my talents, and so my talent's making music. Um, a lot of my music's just about uplifting people, encouraging people, and just being that light towards people. And I feel like that music and through, that, through those tools and through that talent, I could just pour out that happiness towards others. Why do I want to be part of Mr. GCU? Um, just like performing in front of people, like putting a smile on everyone's face and being in a warm environment just makes my day and just is so worth willing, you know? Um, and I just love that I was able to make so many new friendships and hopefully continue with those friendships after college. The best part is seeing our different talents that God has given us and it's super cool that God's given us different talents. So we're going to express them on a, on a big scale. It's been a super blessing to see. That dance rehearsal where we all were like, this is our last dance rehearsal and we're doing the show next week, that was the moment where I was like, this, this is my last one. Um, and I think at the, like getting over that kind of like sadness a little bit at dance rehearsal was cool. I think that's more of a like me moment of like having that with like the intimate group that I like work directly with versus like everyone in the arena. So at the arena, it was more of like, oh my gosh, 
I can go home and sleep and not have a nightmare about Mr. GCU or something like that. But it was also cool to like bring our team together in the midst of the bubbles and everything and be like, hey, we just did that and you all should feel really good. Um, but also go home and get some sleep and we can like debrief next week about it. Let's just like take the weekend off, but um, definitely really rewarding for sure. Um, this is crunch time now. We're within a couple weeks of the show and fine tuning everything. So we got to get the script done. We've got to get this dance fine tuned. Everything has got to come together, which normally at this stage in planning Mr. GCU from past experience of friends, like this is the hectic part of it. So it's making sure that everything, like I said, comes together, streamlines together to make a show that people enjoy. So pressure's on for sure, um, but I know that it'll be great in the show. Mine. And that's okay Ain't I said oh. 